Hello everyone, bye guys, you're on. Welcome back to another video with another review. How's it going? Everything okay? Good to have a good great day every day with a smiling face. So we smile a bit and keep continuing. I always wondering about 70-200mm telephoto lens and here it is ready to unboxing, testing, zooming, focusing and anything we need to know about this lens. Here is the stuff which was inside the box. First and very important one is the Canon 70-200mm f4 USM L series lens. Next one is the lens hood. Canon ET74 plastic lens hood. Very useful thing especially for avoiding damages and flares. And last one is the Canon pouch. To keep the lens in, which I never do actually, and that's my first time that I'm doing it. And I have a lot of them, I don't know what to do with them. Here it is, nice and tight. Oh, wait a minute, the pouch has a name at the bottom, the LP1224. Well, I have a name too. In front of the lens we have a 67mm cap, so we can use any kind of 67mm filters. And at the back of the lens we have a metal mount, which I always rather to be, you know, much better than plastic mount. Here we have zoom ring with the zoom range size from 70 to 200 mm. It moves so smoothly in any small size to quickly change it from 70 to 200 mm. So good. This is the focus ring in front of the lens with nice plastic cover to use it manually. Nice and handy which we could instantly do our manual focus without switching into manual mode. Look, as you see it is in autofocus mode and we can still do our manual focus. It has two switch buttons in the middle side of the lens. First one is autofocus and manual focus and the second is focus distance from 1.2 meter up to infinity and 3 meter up to infinity. So the closest focus distance of the lens is 1.2 meters. As we notice by turning the zoom ring and focusing ring, we cannot see any external movement from the lens. All and every movement are inside the lens. That's a really good point because no dust can get in, especially from back of the lens. See, it is totally blocked. Now ready to see the focusing noise test result. It has a very good build quality, this metal construction, to be more stronger. You know, if it just fell down from your hand, which I hope never happened to anyone, ever indeed. The lens is about 710 grams. It has an 8 aperture blade, included 16 elements in 13 groups. The f-stop of the lens begins from f4 down to f32. As it mentioned on the lens, this is an EF lens, meaning that electronic focus, and it works with every Canon US DSLRs. This is USM lens, meaning that ultrasonic motor, mentioning that it should focus so fast and so silent. Well, let's check it out and see the result. Now testing the focusing. Well, I think you saw the test result. That's right, the autofocus on this lens was super fast, silent and accurate. The lens designed for full frame cameras, however, we can use it on crop sensor cameras too. On full frame cameras such as 60 or many other full frame cameras, the focal length of the lens is 70 to 200 mm. But in APS-C size cameras such as 1200D, which it is a crop sensor camera, the focal length of the lens became 112 mm up to 320 mm. Wow, huge zoom range, with this little fiddle tiny, hmm, what if we use it on crop sensor camera? Does it work? Well, I will think about it. Now testing the zoom range of the lens from 70 to 200 mm on a tripod with full frame camera, Canon 6D. Now we're in 70 mm, 100, 135, and 200. Back to the 70. Now testing the same zoom range in the same spot with crop sensor camera, Canon 1200D. 70 millimeter, 100 millimeter, 135, and 200.
The lens doesn't have any image stabilization, so that's why it's a bit cheaper. But uh, it's not good for videography by hand holding. It will be more shaky. So that's a big problem. What? Well, what's the tripod for then? You can use a tripod like me. Yeah, you're right. So solve that problem. Here is the stabilization testing result with Canon 60 by hand holding. See, it's a bit shaky. All right, now I loaded on a tripod in the same position and here is the result. Zooming in. And zooming out. This is my first telephoto lens for Canon Mark. It has a very fast focusing destruct images. Easy to carry with high quality images, but remember that the only thing is the stabilization. So stay steady and enjoy shooting. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel to see more videos. And like always, have a great shooty day. We can use any kind of 67 millimeter filters. Robot super Lens mean that. Motor sound, car sound, airplane, train, and my sound.